What up boys and welcome back to yet another video. So on my live streams of Dragonflight I've been getting a lot of questions on how I've been able to level up or get so many knowledge points for my professions that I use when I gold farm. So in this video I'm going to share a little bit of tips on how to how you can boost up your knowledge by a lot fast. Like my knowledge this is the second day of um of a Dragonflight when this video is recorded. And uh, I got 60 points right here, and then, like, uh, how much is that? Nine points with the one on spent right here into tailoring, and I did that in one day. So it's really fast to boost knowledge uh, on your tunes if you haven't done it before. So all of this, like, maxed out cloth collection and started uh, working into spinning. Like, all of this was done in one day. So we're going to get into that. And if these are the type of videos that you guys are enjoying then make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you'll be notified whenever I upload a video like this one. And also a big thank you to everyone that has uh, supported me by getting the 0 to 10 million gold guide. It really does mean the world to me and there's so many people with so many positive feedbacks on it. So thank you so much once again. And if you have no clue what the book is, it's basically a collection of all the best gold farming methods that I personally use in order to make multiple gold caps. And the best part about it is definitely uh, the fact that it gets constantly updated for free. So the people that bought the book two years ago are still getting all the updates now in Dragonflight. So if you buy it now, discount code Dragonflight 50% off, you'll get all the future updates in every single future expansion as well. Link down below. So uh, when I picked up tailoring, basically there's a couple of quests around the, uh, the artisan's market right here that you can pick up that will give you tailoring knowledge, right? So that's going to boost it by a little bit. Now, with crafting professions, it's relatively simple because once you go to uh, recipes, you can filter by first craft bonus. Now, when you craft these, because it's the first time uh, you crafted the item, when you craft it, you will get knowledge points. So that's what you want to do. You want to level your profession, if it's a crafting profession, to max level. Um, so you can get all the, the basic uh, patterns from the trainer, and then you just filter by first craft bonus, and you craft one of uh, each one. You gotta look away from the unlearned tab, but just to finish the, where you actually have, um, have patterns to craft it. So that alone is gonna bump it up by a ton, right? Now, outside of that, there's this great vendor located right here uh, in the Valdraken, and in order to get reputation with this guy, because he's the RT since Consortium Quartermaster, you gotta do quests that give you reputation with the Valdraken Accord. And once you've done that, you can buy these items. I bought both of them, the first ones right here. And as you can see, study to increase your Dragon Isle tailoring by 10, and then skinning by 15. And the next ones uh, that I can buy is uh, 15, right? And then uh, 10 from tailoring again. So you can only buy these one time though, like it's a one time thing where you buy these, so I bought these as well, and then following that, this is uh, this next point is not my work, obviously, like credits to the people that made this, and to a viewer of mine, DD, who linked it to me, but you have this uh, Reddit thread right here, which was made nine days ago, but it was uploaded as late as the 28th of November when the game came out, and it says open world knowledge points, gotta collect them all. So there's like a list. If you go to um, like every single open world uh, knowledge point that you can pick up is in this uh, Reddit thread. It's absolutely great. So I just scroll down to tailoring and I went around and I picked up all of these little uh, treasures and they give you like three knowledge points each. So just by doing that, I was able to level up my tailoring insanely fast. And uh, so on with my skinning as well. Skinning, gathering, you can just keep on skinning. I keep on picking up flowers and so on. And you'll get the um, you'll get the knowledge upgrades. But it seems like there's like, some kind of cap after a while where you're just not getting the uh, knowledge point. Because uh, I did it for a while and then I did another hour of skinning and I got zero knowledge uh, skill ups from skinning mobs. But regardless, this is fantastic way to just boost up your knowledge points in uh, the beginning and that's what i did there's probably ten thousand other ways of how to get knowledge points but this was fairly easy very few requirements to go out and do it so hopefully this video is going to help a lot of you guys and if it did make sure to subscribe to the youtube video i'm going to link the reddit post down below uh in the description 
alongside with the serial to 10 million gold guide so you guys can check him out that's it for now though thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all in the next video